name is Guang and welcome to my YouTube channel. So today I'll be talking about something that happens on every day on April 2nd. Um, as you know what it is, some people don't know, but it's Autistic Awareness Month. As you can see from the shirt. Yes. So what is the reason why I actually celebrate Autistic Awareness Day? Sorry, I said month. 3, 4, my bad, well, day, but anyways, um, so the reason why is because I myself is autistic, believe it or not, I am autistic, if you watch my um, anti-bullying video somewhere, I'll put it up somewhere, where's that eye stuff, I have no idea, uh, well, I'm gonna put it up there so you guys can actually watch it, but it's from my old phone, so it might be back quality, so I apologize for that, but you can still hear me talking about, you know, yeah. So anyway, so um, for those of you guys that don't know what autism is, autism is is like it's pretty much like a spectrum disorder. So um, people that have it, they have different strengths and different weaknesses. Um, let me give you a great example. Um, me, okay. Um, my example would be about me. Um, uh, my strengths are dancing and um, PE and music. My weaknesses are math, history, science. Actually, not really on the history part and not that much on the science part, but not really on math. So it, this affects me like when I'm in school. So for me, I learn things in a certain way that before like anyone else like for people um i would say for math for math okay so for math um people will like write down like their equation on paper right for me i will do it in the air first and then on paper so like when i do this a lot of people thought like what the hell is he doing <laughs> but yeah um but it actually helps me to be honest it actually really helps me a lot um, I remember myself by taking pictures and videos. If I don't do that, I'm not gonna remember anything at all whatsoever, sadly. Dang, short-term memory. But anyways, so um, yeah. Uh, another great example is there's this kid that is from Molokai, and he is my friend's son, and his strength, he loves talking about history. Like, you talk about the bombing Pearl Harbor, and he can name pretty much the airplanes and the boats and all this sort of stuff. Um, also, another great example of, of autism is, um, it's also, um, I don't know, for me, it's it's also a communication disorder too. So for me, I, I'm not really comfortable talking to people that are my age. I'm also not really comfortable talking to people that are older than me. Hence, I'm not comfortable talking to new people as well. But um, uh, I can talk to people that are younger than me. And um, yeah, but once I, once you introduce um, yourself to me, then I don't really label you as a stranger. All the other people, I label them as strangers. <laughs> So yeah, sorry, uh, no offense, but that's how that's how I am and who I am. Um, even my friend's son, like the first time I met me, he didn't know who I really am, and then apparently he opened up to me a little bit, and then now he's like, "Hey!" <laughs> but yeah, anyways, so um, it's 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 a weird mental disorder, but it really has a great benefit. <laughs> If that makes any sense, I really hope it does. So there's actually a lot of famous people that actually have autism. Um, if you count the dead people, this will be funny. Um, believe it or not, Albert Einstein is autistic. Yes, the Albert Einstein. Also Mozart. Can you believe that Mozart is autistic? You will not believe why. Um, well, I can tell you Mozart is autistic because he has a habit of not staying still, which is also me. <laughs> um, I, Albert Einstein, he lacks social skills because, you know, he um, 
I'm not quite sure about his past, but I know he lacks social skills. Yeah, so if you kind of notice from that, it's mostly because of social uh, interactions and communicating and stuff. So it's not only for like school or work, but it's also for communicating with other people. It's weird. It's really, really weird. Like for me also, I can't stay still in one place. I have to like move something on my body. Like I may be like, my leg may be shaking or I have to like do it on my phone, but um, I actually can focus while doing all those things. It's weird. People think it's weird, but you know, that's, that's who I am. That's how it is. Um, this is also one of the reasons why I love wearing all blue because Autistic Awareness Day, you get to wear blue. That's right, a blue. My favorite color that I've been wearing for two years, for two years and counting straight. Yeah, so um, I really do like supporting Autistic Awareness Day as well because um, I feel like a lot of people just don't just don't understand how what autistic people go through. They go through a lot of tough times, and even and a lot of autistic pe people get bullied too. It's just weird. I mean, come on, like they're humans like us. So why are you treating them like crap? Just because they act differently, they think differently, they see the whole world in a different perspective or or anything. Um, I personally didn't really have um, any mental health. I mean, I do have a psych uh, psychologist and I have um, educational assistants or teacher's aides that, you know, help me and follow me around. Um, shout out to you, Kanani, my beautiful, because you're my EA that been following me, around, following me around for all four years of high school. So yeah, thank you. Thank you so much. Um, because of that, I was able to graduate high school. Yay! <laughs> yeah, but on, but on a serious note, um, I just wish that a lot of people just, you know, just take the time to know what autism is and also just, you know, just care about people that are autistic. I mean, I'm not, I'm not like, I'm not saying like, oh, people with like Tourette's or ADHD, like I'm not cutting them off. But most importantly, like in general, I just want people to know that, you know, like if people have like a mental disability, you should really, really not only be careful, but also just understand like, if you're picking on them, if you're talking bad about them, if you're bullying them and stuff, think about how much of a struggle that they already are because of that mental disability that they have so come on we're all human here so yeah um i just hope you guys understand that that this day is actually one, one of the most important days in my life and i'm glad that i support this day and spread awareness for autism because you know a lot of people don't like i said a lot of people don't really know what it is and it's just Blank to them. <laughs> so yeah, um, for those of you guys who actually do support Autistic Awareness Day, April 2nd, thank you so much. Wear blue. <laughs> yeah, wear blue for Autistic Awareness Day. Hooray. But yeah, um, thank you guys for, you know, just hopefully you guys will understand um, what I'm saying. I hope this will also help you guys throughout your life at all, at, throughout your whole life. And hopefully you'll um, come to an understanding that, you know, that, that, you know, um, this, an autistic person may be your best friend or something. You may never know. We're all human here. So, um, so yeah, I hope you do support. I really do hope you do. Anyway, so before I end the video, I do guys say something about um, the web series. So those of you guys that don't know, I'm in a web series called Triple Threat Web Series. The links will be down below the trailer video and episode one. Yes, episode one came out last week. 
and I've been watching it on replay a lot of times. But um, also, we extended our campaign, and we actually, from today, we actually hit the 2,000 mark. Yes, we raised about $2,000 just for, you know, shooting more episodes. Um, unfortunately, we have about $10,000 more to go, but it's okay. No matter how much you contribute, whether it's like a dollar, five dollars, ten dollars, or whatever, if you really want to choose a perk, you can. If you don't want to choose a perk, that is okay. Like I said, you can donate as little as like a dollar. And I, like every donation that you guys give, every all the money is all gonna go to my producer, my director, the editor, the composer, us actors for food, for makeup, location fees, marketing fees, all that other stuff. It's all for us. It's not for like, you know, like we're taking money and it's a scam or something. No, this is actually something that is happening here in Hawaii and I hope you guys will support that. Yeah. So all the links will be down below and I hope you check them out. Um, I hope you guys also like the trailer video or this is a reel and the first episode. Episode two will come out soon, I hope. I don't know when yet, but if episode two comes out, I will let you guys know. It will be all over my social media too. <laughs> so yeah. Anyways, so other than that, I hope you guys do enjoy this video. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up, comment down below, subscribe to me so you can follow me on my YouTube journey. Um, again, Again, for those of you guys that um, support Autistic Awareness Day, April 2nd of every year, thank you so much. Like, just, just by spreading the awareness, it makes a big impact in the world. Like, you may never know, like, someone that's autistic may think of dying, and then next thing you know, this person is like, hey, I, I support you, I know how it is to be autistic, or like, I know, I have a friend that's autistic or a brother or sister that is autistic. Um, I totally understand what you're going through. You can change people's lives just by spreading awareness. It's awesome. It is so awesome. Like words can't not describe that, um, that this is an actual day. <laughs> um, so yeah, uh, make every day a great day. Um, I'll see you guys in the next video. Make a big difference. Change the world. We can take over the world to make it a better place. Bye-bye.